Hello and welcome to Regina's Never Fail Recipes. Few weeks back, I uploaded a video on organizing kitchen. That is five tips for organizing the kitchen. So I got a lot of good reviews about that and I'm very happy about it. So people got motivated to organize their kitchen. So today I'm going to share with you my daughter-in-law Maria, how she got motivated and organized her kitchen. So let's go and see her kitchen. Over to Maria. my mother-in-law had posted a video on YouTube on how to organize your kitchen. So that has, that video has inspired me to clear out and clean out my kitchen. Wanna see what happened? Come. So the first thing I did after watching my mother-in-law's organizing video is to clear out my counter space. I have a long counter and have more than enough counter space. So I used to keep everything on my counter, my uh, food tupperwares, my pots, pans, my glasses, everything used to be on the counter itself. And I used to keep, uh, after, even after drying my, uh, my glasses, my spoons and all, they used to be on the counter itself. So I decided to clear out my counter counters and uh, organize it into these counter, uh, these shelves. So the first thing I did, I uh, organized my food storage here, like uh, Tupperwares and all, glass vessels, Tupperwares and all. These are organized here, easily accessible and I know where everything is. My pots and pans are here. And I have some more steel utensils here, my cast iron pan and all. It's all in their place. So I know where it is and it is easily accessible. And this is another thing I did. This is my food storage. It used to be out up here in the counter and it used to clutter up the space. So I decided to keep it here, easily accessible but out of sight. And so my counter is right now clean and little good actually. The only thing on my counter right now is the things I use on a daily basis. Uh, my, tish, uh, my kitchen towels, oils uh, and my mixer thing. That is, that is the only thing there on the counter. And that is stuff that you use every day. So I, I cannot really keep it everywhere, anywhere. So I keep it here. My garbage bins used to be uh, out here. And it used to be, uh, it used to take a lot of space. And it was a garbage bin. Anyway, they're not that pleasant to see. You don't really want to get into the kitchen and look at a garbage bin. So what I did was I clear out these uh, count, these uh, shelves because we don't really use them. Uh, uh, it's under the sink so it gets damp in here. So we don't really use those space. So what I did was I put my garbage bins. I cleared out everything uh, that was there. I cleared out here and I put my garbage bins here. Another thing I took away from my, from my mother-in-law's uh, video is to keep the sink clean and dry. Looking at a dry sink is a very good thing. A clean uh, space gives you a very good feeling. So I did that. I do that on a regular basis uh, after watching my mother-in-law's video. Thank you for inspiring me to organize my kitchen. Hope you all uh, will organize your kitchen and leave us a comment below. Thanks for watching. Like, share and subscribe.